Nicole. He's live in the studio with whom they want to meet with about this matter, Travers. That's right, Stella. A very interesting story. They want to meet with the district attorney in Jefferson Parish to talk about upgrading these charges as they feel the man arrested should still be behind bars. In this quiet Harvey neighborhood on Chickapin Street. It don't make no sense. Emotions still run high. The Weber family is angry and upset. I feel like it's an injustice. 57 year old Garland Weber was shot and killed last Monday. A husband and father to these women. They're shocked the accused shooter is only charged with manslaughter, not murder. My dad was tracked down and then executed across the street. JPSO quickly arrested 67 year old Lawrence Sly Sr. for the crime. He lives right next door to the Webbers. Cops say the two men have had issues for years. In fact, Weber was arrested two years ago after the two men got into a scuffle. JPSO says given the evidence, Sly is charged properly with manslaughter. He also posted bond and was released from jail last week. I think the DA should have did their job and actually investigated before you release someone. Then nobody contacted us, no one told us anything. They had it like, oh, they had an argument. Now this family wants to meet with the district attorney to discuss upgrading the charges, which can legally be done. Until then, they say they're forced to live next door to the man accused of killing their loved one. This is my family's home. My mother lived here, my sister lived here, and also her children. So how can these children return back to the home they lived in when someone murdered their, their grandfather on a Monday and was out by a Friday? We should point out that manslaughter is a bondable offense in Louisiana, so there is nothing legally preventing Sly from being released from jail. Gina.